So this is what I've wanted to do for a while now, so enough sitting on it. Let's just do it. Alright, Anthony, the worst assistant in the world who almost got fired today. So my job depends on this phone tap. If this phone tap is good, Anthony, you get to keep your job. Nice. Wow. Alright, here we go. So Kim sent us an email saying her friend Nicole lost her bag the other day. So I decided to call Nicole as the person that found her bag with um, an interesting proposition, to say the least, on how she can get her bag back. Well, here we go. The worst assistant in the world giving you today's phone tap. This is Nicole. Hey, Nicole. It's George. How you doing? Hi. Hi. Uh, how are you? Good. I just got off the phone with uh, your, with your friend Kim, so I guess I found all your stuff. I, I don't even know what to say. I, I really thought it was gone. I, was, I cannot thank you enough for being so nice and calling her and doing this. No, no problem. I was actually having dinner with one of my coworkers, and I thought it was her bag. It wasn't hers, so look through it and whatnot. So I don't want you to think I'm like a creep for going through your stuff. I just didn't know whose bag it was. Oh, no. I mean, please. I, I absolutely appreciate it. I, I've been freaking out. I thought I lost everything. So, I mean, no. Thank you for going through my bag. Yeah, I just I want to be able to get you your stuff pretty soon. Okay. Um, do you want to maybe just meet up by where I work? If yeah. If you just want to come um, over? Yeah. Where Where are you located? I'm actually, it's it, it's going to look kind of weird because it's kind of a warehouse. We're in the adult entertainment industry. Is that, is that What? Actually, you know what? I was wondering, are you looking for a job at all? Because we kind of have some openings um, at my... Uh, what What are you saying? If maybe you wanted to, I don't know, try out, interview, audition. No, wait, uh, um, I'm, I'm confused. You just said that I could... With my company. You're saying that, or asking, are you asking me if, you know, like, I don't okay. really know what you're I'll, saying. I'll, I'll, you just, no, I'll just make this really simple. You, you, I mean, I looked through your phone and stuff, and you're a beautiful, beautiful girl. Um, just wondering if you would be able to do a shoot for us, maybe, in return for your I, bag. First of all, that's completely. You don't really have to even talk that much, to be honest with you. It's not. It's not a big deal. I'm sure you've done it before, right? No, I haven't done it before. I don't. Know, you have you a mean, text here from Brad that says, "From uh, who? From a Brad, I believe. Do you know a Brad? Yes. Yeah, yeah, my it says, boyfriend. Well, I mean, I'm sure you and your boyfriend do some of the things we do here. I mean, are you an on top girl? What? So, it says, I mean, obviously you're you're sexually you active. You sent him a text I need that, to have sex with someone to get my. Isn't this like against the law? It's not a big deal. I'm sure you've it been. It is a big deal. That's completely up. It's prof like, It's very professional. It's very classy here. Who are you? No, no. You need to give me my bag back because it's the right thing to do because it's my bag. Well, yeah, yeah I am going to give you your bag, bag back. Technically, that's stealing, and I don't even know if this is what like blackmailing or something. But no, I'm not. Taking my clothes Wait, you like black? You like black males? Because we can do that too. I don't know. What? I'm just you. You, you brought up the black guys. I would really appreciate it if you could not be such a sleaze bag. I'm not. I'm not being a sleaze bag. It's very classy. Trust me. We've had a lot of women come through I don't here. No, I'm sorry, but porn is not classy. And There's if you need your bag back, it. we kind of need a new girl. No, we am just tell my boyfriend like, oh, sorry, honey, like this guy took my purse, and now in order to get it back, I have to take my clothes off. He can come too. It's cool. I've seen porn. It is all, all of it is degrading. Exactly. It's if you've seen it, you're you're a fan. So why not? You know, join I, in the action. I'm not. I'm not a fan of porn, and I'm not going to do a porn, and I'm not going to take my clothes off. I mean, you should give me my bag back because it's the right thing to do. Because it's my bag. Well, you maybe found, you should help us it. out because it's no, the right thing to do. No, there's no like. How about no, no, no? You need to put my bag in the mail, and I will give you my office address. Uh, you know, the shipping is kind of expensive these days. We don't really have the money to do that. So if you just come down. <laughs> this is Nicole. Yeah. Did you get your stuff? No, no, I didn't get my stuff because he called me and he told me that if I wanted to get my purse back, I would have to come and meet him at a warehouse and make a porno. <laughs> what? Yeah. He right. owns or runs or works at or something, some porn series for amateur porn. And he said he saw the pictures of me in my bag and that if I wanted my first stuff, I would have to go and take my clothes off and, and be in a porn. Well, why don't you just go pick up your stuff? Are you crazy? I can go pick up my stuff. I can go to some empty warehouse where they shoot well, porn. Take, take Brad with you. No, no, they said that if I, no, no way, no way, he will freak oh. out, and plus, I even, I even told them I had a boyfriend, and they were like, oh, he can be in the porn, I'm sure it's not that big of a deal, when I, I talk to him on the phone, it's not a deal, are you crazy, like, I got really upset, and like, he like, wouldn't, he wouldn't take like, no for an answer, I just, I asked him if he would maybe just send it to my office, and he could say no, no, like, you have to do something for me, if I'm gonna do something for you, and that's how the world works, like, I do a favor for you, you do a favor for me, you take your clothes off. <laughs> got a point. He found your stuff. I mean, what, what do you mean he is? Are you crazy? He has a point.
point? Yeah, you should probably do something for him. I'm not saying oh God, go no, do no, no, that. But I, I don't even, like, I'm sorry. I can't I'm even talk to you right now. Have a great time on your date. This is stuff. The fact that you would send me to a where else to pick up my purse. Hey, Nicole. Nicole, are you still there? What, what are you, why are you laughing? Hey, Nicole, it's Anthony from Elvis Duran in the Morning Show. How are you? Sorry. Are you kidding me? You have now? just been phone tapped. Oh, my God. I hate you, Kim. No, I you know what so I'm reading now. <laughs> I'm just getting you back for the stripper at my birthday party. I, I can't believe you did this. Elvis Duran phone Let's hope she did get the purse back. We can only hope. Elvis Duran in the Morning Show phone taps. Bringing families together. Tearing their homes apart.